Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is the first video of my new series. We're gonna be trying some Asian snacks and beverages from my local Asian market that I went and picked up. And I haven't tried anything here except for this one item. So it'll all be new stuff, I think for both of us. Have you, ever, have you had anything here? Not really, I don't think, no. All right, this should be fun then. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Here we go, let's get started. What do you want to start with? There's so there's so much, you guys. Can I try these first? Sure, let's do it. Play it safe. Here, let me show them. Okay. Alright, so we got some some cucumber flavor lays. I hope that's showing up well. So this will be our first item that we're gonna try today. They look good. Interesting. I, I wonder what cucumber flavor chips taste like. That's it's awesome! So <laughs> Why aren't ours like that? Yeah, for real. It's got a little cup thing. Right. I'm struggling. Well, it tastes like cucumber. Oh my gosh, it does. That's weird. I think I give that like a 7 out of 10 just because it's weird. <laughs> I'd say a 6 out of 10. So hard. Alright, let's try these. They are barbecue corn snacks. Let's see how they start. Oh, they look cool. Oh, they smell weird. It kind of just reminds me of a cereal for some reason. They don't have a ton of flavor, but I kind of like that. And they're, like they're nice and soft. Yeah, they're like even softer than Fritos. Yeah. I think I like these. Mm -hmm. I'd say they're a solid like nine. I agree with that. I like that they're not just like drenched in flavoring and yeah. they didn't get my fingers messy yeah, or anything. Not. So nine out of ten. Those are good. Alright, you get to pick the next one. Okay. Do you wanna try a drink here? If you want, sure. I'll try the bubble tea. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> Oh, Royal. Oh, I wonder if this is the uh, the brand that does the Royal Milk Tea. <laughs> you're like, I don't know, you're asking the wrong person. <laughs> oh, I can't. I don't know. <laughs> I can try. <laughs> no. uh, Do I have to run in it? <laughs> oh, you have to try it first. does taste like royal milk tea. Oh, I wonder if it's royal milk bubble tea. Mm. Nah, I'd say it's about like a four, four. Five, a five. I don't like boba, you guys. I have no idea what these are. They said cheese on them, and that was enough for me. That is really salty. Ooh, that is salty. Yeah. You can kind of taste the cheese. Barely. It kind of reminds me of rice cake. Yeah, but really salty. Yeah. That's like a 4 out of 10 for me. It didn't really taste like cheese, it just tasted like salt, really. I'd say a four too. It's really not. All right, you get to pick the next thing. Maybe you'll pick something better. Okay. Hmm. Here we go with. Let's do it. Banana chocolate banana pocky. Yeah, I don't think I've had that before. It Maybe? tastes like laffy taffy. Yeah. Like straight up. And I think that the 
that the cookie part is supposed to be chocolate, but it doesn't really taste like it. And it just tastes like that because it's pretty good though. I kind of like it because it's that flavor, mm -hmm. but it's not something you're chewing on forever. I'll give it a strong seven. I think I'm giving it an eight. I like it. I think I'd actually buy this again. It looks like it's caramel something by the packaging. It looks like caramel Cheetos. <laughs> but there's no English words on this. Whoa. Is that a good bow? Oh, my mouth is watering now. Ooh. I'm gonna moisturize my lips on accident. Oh, it smells like donuts. Mm -hmm. It tastes like a donut hole. How? Oh my gosh, that is so good. If they were a little softer, I'd like them even more. I think they're like an eight. Yeah. If they were softer, just like slightly, I'd easily give them a 10. Mm -hmm. They're pretty crunchy. Like, like crunchy like and chips. Twist. My foot is asleep. <laughs> All right, it's your turn to pick. Okay. Let's go with the mushrooms. I got oh. it from a different store, so. I just want to show the oh, packaging. Right. It's like, the little bag is so cute. It it's really got is. Little, that's adorable. The box is cute too, all the little. Yeah. Mm. Yep, they're the same mm -hmm. thing. Always 10 out of 10. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite Asian snack ever. All right, uh, we haven't tried these two drinks yet. Let's try the mango drink first. It says it has pulp in it. Real fruit pieces. There was a lot of new stuff at the Asian market when I went there, so I haven't gotten to try a lot of the things. Whoa. Ooh. Mm. <laughs> I like that. So it's good, but I wasn't expecting all the chunks to just... <laughs> the chunks kind of throw me off a little bit. Like, I thought it was just gonna be a little bit, but... Yeah, no, it's just straight up mango in a can. But it's I feel good. like if you put this in a blender with ice, <laughs> you could just easily make a smoothie and it's not too sweet. It's like I could drink this whole can and not like feel sick because it was too sweet or anything like that. Yeah, that's 10 out of 10. Yeah, I agree. 10 out of 10. I kind of like the chunks in it too. Do you want to go for the spicy shrimp? Let's do it. <laughs> Some spicy shrimp crackers, you guys. Shrimp crackers. Mm. Oh. Oh, I didn't think they'd be that spicy. Oh, I don't like the fish flavor, but I like the spicy. Yeah. It's a lot spicier than I thought it would be. Tastes like shrimp. It's not like too spicy, but... I give the spiciness a five, but I give the shrimp a one. <laughs> oh, my sinuses feel better. Because uh, it was spicy. Yeah, the fish flavor is really gross, though. Yeah, it <laughs> But... Those are the shrimp crackers. I mean, yeah. it tastes like dried shrimp. Yeah, if it didn't have the shrimp flavor, I'd like those. It'd be like a... So if they weren't shrimp crackers. <laughs> yeah, it'd be like a hot Cheeto, but softer and like spicy, but it doesn't just taste like hot sauce, which is what hot Cheetos taste like to me. I, I like hot Cheetos, but honestly, it just tastes like I'm eating hot sauce. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's my turn. The uh, bubble milk tea cake. Oh, that's and fancy. Adorable. This would be cute to like bring as a house gift or something like that. Oh wow. There's like a little taste inside. It smells good. It kind of smells like a fig. It doesn't taste like milk tea to me, but it just tastes like a cake. It tastes like a fig to me, but yeah. like but like a cake or fig. And it's a little drier, but that's because there's more 
of the cakiness. I think this would be good with milk. Or tea. Or tea. Mm. It would be really good with milk tea. <laughs> oh, take a drink of that. <laughs> ready for the snacks. <laughs> I've had these before but not this flavor. I had the original ones and they just kind of taste like a milkshake. Are these the candies that you got me the last time? Toxic. They're green. Oh. It's really hard to chew. It kind of tastes like a honeydew milkshake in a candy. getting my happy vibes again. Mm. Yeah, I'd say that's a solid 10. Yeah. Especially since it was as exactly as advertised. Mm -hmm. Here we go, some sweet chili flavored chip fried looking thingies. <laughs> Alright Javi, this is how you open a package. You ripped the bag too. Not nearly as bad as you. You ripped it all the way down the side. I, I didn't rip it all the way down the side. Oh, they're like Oof. little. My nose is burning. I mean, that sounds promising though. What I want to know is how they get so much flavor on these snacks, but they're not just covered in powder. In dust, like yeah. Keto's or any kind of chip. Wait, how are they doing that? They're like veggie straws, but sweet chili flavor and it's really good. I like it. Yeah, I like it too. I think it's good. Kiwi fruit drink. This has pulp. Oh. Uh -huh. It's kind of like drinking syrup. Like a water Like that. It tastes like it's, a melted popsicle. Yeah, it's kind of. <coughs> it burns my throat a little. It's kind of thick. I don't. I didn't get any of the pulp. Maybe I should have shaken it up or something. Did you shake that No. <laughs> it was a lie. I'd say the mango one is definitely better than this one. I highly agree. But I also prefer mango over kiwi. Me too. All right, so we just have one item left to try. So we're gonna go make this real quick because we can't, I mean, we could just eat it, but that wouldn't be the full experience. Eating this with our makeup on is gonna be fun. Oh yeah. So it, it looks like it's spicy beef flavor, some sort of ramen. I've never had this brand or anything before. My hopes aren't very high though because I don't really like prepackaged ramen that much. But we're gonna go ahead and go make this and then we'll come back and try it. All right, we are back. The ramen is done. It just had us put everything in a bowl and then pour water over it, boiling water. So it wasn't too hard to make. Do you wanna I'll be living on the edge. Ooh, I like that. I almost wish that it was a little thicker. Mm -hmm. Maybe we put too much water. It looks fine. I don't know. I like it actually it is a little spicy, but in a good way. Mm -hmm. I like spicy stuff, though. It's not too spicy to the point you can't taste it. Helping my sinuses up. Okay, so what was your favorite thing out of everything? Um, probably the mango drink and those were both really good. Uh, this is hard. I liked so much stuff. Yeah, I also um, liked the, the milk candies. I think that the mango drink was my favorite drink. These sweet chili chips were my favorite savory treat, and then the choco shrooms were my favorite sweet treat. Though most of the stuff was pretty good, so. And then what was your least favorite thing? 
Yeah, the shrimp. <laughs> shrimp crackers. The shrimp crackers. We did not like those. Uh, they were not good. The shrimp crackers and these cheese things were both not good to me. At least these were spicy. Yeah. This was just salty. It wasn't good. <laughs> I wonder if, if someone would want them because I don't want them. <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the first the first video of the new series on my channel. I, I do plan to start a couple other series on here uh, so that there's a little variation and it's not just the same thing every time. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and comment and see you next time. Bye.